The Hoppy and Super Rich Show. Hoppy and Super Rich. Only on WNUR 89.3 FM. This is the Hoppy and Super Rich Show. I'm Ryan Hoppy. I am Ryan Stupper, J.K.A. Super Rich. And that was enough for classy news of the day. Now it's time for riveting news. And uh, it says here, Derek Jeter dumps model Hannah Davis over her growing fame. So pretty much along with his big head, he does have a big head because he can't take the fact that she's high and she's getting more famous than him because he's past his prime and he's a douchebag. So what happened? <laughs> I wasn't the douchebag. But... Uh, kind of. He gives out gift baskets after you bang him at his house, and he says, get out. It's actually true. I saw it on Deadspin. <laughs> Jeter dumps model Hannah Davis over her growing fame, who is very attractive, by the way. Straight lace, Derek Jeter has broken up with swimsuit model Hannah Davis as her fame grows through her sexy photo shoots for Sports Illustrated. Hopefully they're in next week's issue. Uh, we're told the Yankee shortstop and the Virgin Islands born, ooh, Virgin Islands born, model have gone their separate ways after just less than a year of dating. Cheater appears to have an issue with his girlfriends becoming well known. He and actress Minka Kelly, who's also very attractive, split in 2011 after three years together. How badass must that be that, like, if she were going out with us, I wouldn't care if she had people taking pictures of her all the time. I wouldn't care that she constantly has dudes hitting on her. But for Derek Jeter, he's like, oh, Hannah, Hannah Davis, a swimsuit model? I can bang whoever I want. I got Minka Kelly. I'm Derek Jeter. I can bang. I can have intercourse with any vagina I want. Like, how awesome is that? <laughs> Just think about it. Truly think about it. I don't it. want to think about he it. He dumped Hannah Davis because he can get any girl he wants. Yeah. As, as so he dumped, you know, Mika Kelly as her career began to take off with The Roommate, uh, which was a decent movie. The filming of Charlie's Angels and a racy shoot for GQ. One source told us Derek likes to keep his relationships quiet, which is kind of true. In the past, when his girlfriends become famous and started doing sexy shoots, that's when they break up. Exactly the same thing happened with Minka and v- Vanessa Minillo. So obviously, Derek Jeter is the man in the house. Like He wants to control everything. So obviously, if there's anything kinky about his sex life, he obviously is not into dominatrixes because he wants to control <laughs> everything. I don't think there's any leashes going around Derek Jeter's head anytime soon. <laughs> Jeter and Davis, who's the face of Ralph Lauren Fragrance, Ralph Rocks, and also has modeled for Victoria's Secret. That just sounds really sexy. Like, any girl that's a part of that organization, the new not boss. flappy chests. They're all, or they don't have, like, roles. They have flappy to be hot. Chests. That made no sense. Uh, kept their relationship very low-key, spending time together at his mansion in Tampa and at the Gramercy Park Hotel in New York. Of course, this egotistical douchebag wants to keep a low key. He doesn't want to be seen out in public where more people are looking at his hot girlfriend like TMZ, those uh, trolls, because he knows that he's past his prime. He hasn't won a World Series since 09. He's constantly hurt. Yeah, he had a years ago, but like, it just seems like he has a problem where he's getting older, he's going to be retiring soon, and he wants to be the man of He doesn't want people looking at his hot girlfriend's chest. <laughs> Another source said, Derek and Hannah broke up a few months ago. She wasn't at his Celebrity Golf Classic last month. He is in Tampa and is completely focused on being fit and ready for the upcoming baseball season. I love how people are so unfocused on Derek Jeter. If you're at a Derek Jeter golf event, like if I got invited to one, I would be so pumped to see everybody there, all the athletes that he's friends with, all the media people from ESPN because ESPN goes down on the Yankees all the time, so you know they're like butt buddies. But uh-huh. I love how he's so past his prime and almost unrelevant. Yeah, yeah, he's one of the greatest players of all time for the MLB, but he's so unrelevant now that people didn't notice that his girlfriend was there. They're right. like, where's Hannah Davis? That's Derek Jeter right there. No, but where's Hannah Davis? Like, no one cares about you anymore. <laughs> Jeter, 39, so he's already 39 years old. That's right? what I'm saying. He's almost at the midlife crisis. of. He's at a midlife crisis now, actually. Because if you're jealous of your girlfriend, you're at a midlife crisis. Oh, buddy, you need to go to some therapy. I'm serious. <laughs> so Jeter stayed in Florida for Super Bowl weekend, while Davis, who's 23, was spotted at Friday's Men Fitness Shape Super Bowl party and Saturday's DirecTV events, including their Celebrity Beach Bowl you and know, Saturday night yeah. 
uh, with a performance by Jay Z and Beyonce. You no, know, yeah, she definitely. Ahead. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. You know, she definitely went to that party where all the guys were all classy and rich, showing off her TNA, wearing sexy perfume. She definitely put on a good amount of makeup. She got her hair all done. She definitely didn't eat a lot because she didn't want to have any chance of having to go to the bathroom and ruining backdoor action later on. I'm just saying, I feel. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, you definitely know she was trying to rub it in the face because all the guys were like, oh my God, it's Derek Jeter's girlfriend. Like, she wanted to be on top of her game. Yeah. At both, we're told. Hannah looks sensational. She was with her friend. She definitely wasn't with the date. Davis back in the tw- it's back in the 2014 Sports Illustrated swimsuit edition, which I will be receiving for free thanks to my subscription to Sports Illustrated. You read magazines? What the hell's wrong with you? What are you, some 80 year old guy? Uh, I, I I I get you know Sports Illustrated, and then every year the swimsuit issue comes for free, which is nice. Dude, she's 23 years old, man. I know, it's and I'm like 19. That's skin. not even that. Like she graduated high school when we graduated eighth grade. Like she's like the same age as one of my co-hosts, Leo, on my network, com. Just a quick plug. But, <laughs> I mean, she's the same age around us. Like, we could be banging her. Come on, call the show, 847-866-WNUR. We're horny. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Which last week released a picture of her wearing a revealing... Sports Illustrated it. Yeah. A, a revealing cut-off T-shirt uh emblazoned with the slogan New Jersey Strong. It should say Ghetto Strong because New Jersey isn't very strong or ghetto. Our first source added the picture probably made millions of men very happy but not Derek Jeter. Who cares? And there's millions of magazines out there that are hard to open and they're very gluey. You know what I mean? (laughs) Get what I did there? I'm talking about them masturbating their semen. Mm -hmm. All right. We're going to play a song but portions of WNUR's programming may be inappropriate for younger and more sensitive listeners. Yes, and we, uh, WNUR believes this material to be artistically and culturally significant. We will play this music only between the hours of 11.30 p.m. and 6 a.m. as you all know. And since his girlfriend is very good looking, Hannah Davis, Derek Jeter, and he's been with a lot of girls because he gives out those these gift baskets, we know that a lot of those girls to shake their money maker and since this song was shake raked money maker. Mm-hmm. shake it on me baby <laughs> here's the deal since this song came out in 2007 we just talked about a hot swimsuit model and we all wish you would shake it on us all night long, mm-hmm. we're, all night long. We're, we're so nervous that we can't reach the top of the mountain because it's unreal that hannah davis is banging us well yeah we're gonna play ludicrous money maker and then come back and before we get up on out of here we're gonna have Kim Kardashian's love advice that it will be riveting. But first, Mom. here's Moneymaker. On uh, WNUR 89.3. The Hoppy and Super Rich Show. Hoppy and Super Rich. Only on WNUR 89.3 FM.